Okay, we're gonna play a fun little game called Stealing Hearts. So let me go over a couple of the specials we have going on right now so that it'll generate some questions for you and then I'll tell you how we're gonna play. Um, this month, when you guys spend $70 or more before tax or shipping, you get some of our summer favorites. You can choose from our two-quart quick stir pitcher, our barbecue turner, barbecue tongs, the barbecue cleaning brush, or the two-quart collapsible bowl. So great, great um, extra. It's free when you spend $70 or more, um, and I'll let you pick that out when you come to check, up, check out. May is also our Help With Cancer month. So only in May we have some pink products that are available, um, and I'll pass this around for y'all to see, but you can choose from our pink products, and each one that you purchase, one dollar is donated to the American Cancer Society. That doesn't sound like a whole lot, but when there's 55,000 consultants selling these pink products for the entire month, it adds up. Typically every May, Pampered Chef raises over a half a million dollars just in the month of May, so it really does make a difference. Um, these also make great, um, little gifts for girls going off to college. Everyone loves pink. Every girl loves pink, so it makes great gifts. If you know someone that is a breast cancer survivor, they're great for them, or someone that's going through breast cancer right now, this is a great product to give them, because then you can let them know that you're supporting the American Cancer Society. Um, this month, we have a great get, um, host special, and Jennifer is going to be eligible to get one of our cool and Surf sets. 60% off. I only have two dates left, so if you would like to get a cool and serve tray 60% off and host your own party, I have May 18th and May 19th. Um, otherwise, anyone could also do a catalog party this month and you'd also be eligible. Our host special is always in addition to all the free that you're going to earn. The best reason to host a party is the free you're going to get. You're going to pick what you want. This is just kind of like icing on the cake. So even if you don't like the cool and serve, but May is a great time for you to host, you don't have to purchase this, or you could get it 60% off, put it in your gift closet, and give it to someone when they have a bridal shower or whatever. Um, but that is the May special. June is double free. And I only have three dates left in June, so if you want to party in June, you better get on my calendar, and it is double free. If you have a $1,000 party instead of $215 in free, you are going to get $430 in free products of your choice. I don't pick what they are, the company doesn't, you will pick from the complete catalog. And you'll get half price and then 30% off everything else, so great, great time to host in June. Everybody likes getting together, school's out, you know, um, not everybody goes on vacation the entire summer, so get your girlfriends together and we can have a Mexican fiesta, or we can do wine, cheese, and chocolate, you know, whatever you want to do, we can do this pesto tortellini again if you love it. Um, I am not, oh, I haven't updated this yet, I am not a Pampered Chef psychic, so I never can tell who is going to be the next person to join my team and get paid to party. This month, we're going to pretend that this says it's $100 of products of your choice. In addition to your commission you're going to earn and Pampered Chef dollars you'll earn, giving the business a try for 30 days, do two or three parties, you're going to get $100 to pick additional products of your choice, plus your commission, plus some Pampered Chef dollars. So that is our current incentive. This is kind of a snapshot of what a Pampered Chef business looks like for 30 days. I'm very visual. I like to see it on paper. If you would like, there's some extra copies of that in the front, so feel free to take one. Um, this little flyer is kind of the frequently asked questions about the business. And then on the back is a really great visual of comparing a regular job to a Pampered Chef job and how few hours it takes to make the same you would make in a different, a different job. So I really like seeing that. Um, we have all different apron sizes. In other words, there's no one reason to try Pampered Chef. I did it for a social outlet. I have a lot of my team that do it for extra income in addition to their full-time job. There are some that do it just to get certain products in the catalog, and once they get them, they're good and done, and they move on. You may need to pay off some credit card debt, so do it long enough to pay off your debt. In other words, there's not one particular apron. Anybody can try this business. On the back of that flyer is my paycheck from March of this year, so just um, this past March. I did six cooking shows, two freezer workshops, eight catalog shows, and had ten online orders. So basically I worked six days out of the month because I left my house and did what we're doing here six times, and then I had two freezer workshops at my own house. So eight days out of the month, I made $4,235.18. Remember, my money is mine. My husband's is ours. <laughs> um, we also offer fundraisers. If you ever have a fundraiser need of any kind, it can be a traveling ball team, Girl Scout troop, Boy Scout troop, dance team, 
a mission trip, medical related, anything you can think of, we do fundraisers. You can either do it cooking style or catalog. You're going to get 25% profit, 15% of that comes from the company, and then 10% comes from commission that I will donate. So, you know, everybody has to eat. There's always something that people can find in the catalog. You can take orders from anyone in the country. So unlike your pizza kits and your cookie dough that Grandma and Grandpa in California can't order, or your coupon books that are only for the Birmingham area, anyone in the country can order and your organization is going to get credit for it. And then if you know anyone getting married, we have wedding registries and wedding showers that you can do. So you can pamper your friends and have them have their kitchens equipped with the right stuff from the beginning. So I'll pass that around. Y'all can look at that. We're going to play Stealing Hearts, and here's how it's going to work. You guys may ask me anything about hosting a show or anything about being a consultant. Even if you don't care what the answer is, chances are someone else in the room might. And the more questions you ask, the more cards you'll have, which means the more chances you'll have to win my free prizes that I have. So you can ask me about hosting a show or about being a consultant. I'll leave out products because we went through a lot. I'll answer questions about those after the game. This is just an entertaining way for you guys to pick my brain. we got to wait for our pasta to finish, and there's only so much I can come up with saying. So we're just doing the suit of hearts, which means you guys can ask me 13 questions. You can be as nosy as you would like. So what would you like to know? Yes? Can I set up a vendor booth at Tanny Hill? Yes. To sell my Abs pepper chef? Absolutely. Awesome. Yes. Vendor events are awesome. Yes? Do you have to do just cooking shows? No, you can do um, Facebook parties, you can do catalog parties, you can, cooking parties are typically going to have, you know, the host is going to get more because I'm the one doing the work, versus if you were doing a catalog show, you are the one doing the work, I'm just getting paid for it. How many trips have you went on? From your I have gone on a trip each year, so we have been on two cruises, San Francisco, Paris, France, Maui, Los Cabos, Punta Cana which is in the Dominican Republic, um, Disney World, and in 40 days we'll leave for Disneyland. And then wow. this year you guys are helping me um, finish to earn a trip to Atlantis that will be next April. Oh. What else? Oh. How much commission do you make? Um, a new consultant will make anywhere from 20 to 25 percent commission. If any of you in the room are familiar with either Mary Kay, Premier Jewelry, some of the others that make 50 percent, when I say 20 to 25, you're like, Phew. She's crazy. That's dumb. Why would you do that? But you have to compare apples to apples. I don't pay a single dime for the host rewards. If all of y'all use debit cards and credit cards, I don't pay to process those. I also don't pay any enrollment fee every year to stay in the business. The only thing I pay each year is $10 a month to have a personal website. One order a month will pay for that. So on average, in direct selling, every business you'll make about $100 once you bring it to apples to apples. How many like online, not online parts, online orders do you get just from your website for not doing anything? Um, it just depends. I mean, around Christmas time, a ton of them. Other times, there I may go a month and not have any, or I may have you know five, ten. It just kind of depends. Y'all gonna get prizes? Participate. What do you want to know? Even if you know the answer, you can still ask. Now, how long did it take you to become a director? Um, I started, my first party was in February, and I promoted November 1st of the same year. So how many levels are there? There is consultant, and then once you have one team member, you're a senior consultant, two team members, you're a team leader, five team members, you're a director, and then there's advanced director, senior director, executive, senior exec, and national. And you're executive? I am working to become an executive. Right now I'm an advanced director team. How do you get your recipes? Um, we have tons of recipes online. You don't have to do Pampered Chef recipes either. You can, if you have a family favorite recipe, you can do that. There's nothing that says you have to do Pampered Chef recipes. But the website has a bazillion recipes. We also share a lot of recipes among our team. So a lot of times we'll find out what people are cooking. And if it's working good at their shows, then we share that information. And we can all share the love. Does your husband have a favorite product? Um, the trips. <laughs> the trips, okay. Um, he uses all of it. My kids use all of it. They are very spoiled. When they okay. go, like, to my sister's house or other family that doesn't have as much, they complain. So he does use all of it. Yes? Um, he's been trying to drum up business. Um, is, if he gets so many, like, 
that sell more than two hundred dollars, can it be considered like a catalog? Oh, absolutely. Yes. Yeah. Two hundred dollars in sales is all it needs to be to count as can a party. Can you put it as like as anybody like mm -hmm. my sister-in-law? Yep. I could put her name down as the host, yep. and she would reward, get rewarded for the. Yeah. Even though she probably didn't oh, do yeah. any of the. Yeah. Okay. I mean, as long as he's okay with giving up for doing the work, yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> does, it, does it matter how you sell? No. Group the nickel for him to use. Um, yeah, advertising, there is some you have to be somewhat careful, but if you look on Consultants Corner, they'll give you the guidelines for, because you're representing the company name, so you do have to fall within some parameters, but otherwise, you can. The only thing we cannot do is we cannot set up a storefront. We cannot set up an actual store. How much is it to sign up? That is the best product that we have. And if you will look on the back cover of your catalog, and you act like you have one, we have two different kits. The main starter kit's $159. It comes with $600 worth of products and paperwork, everything you need to get started. You get a website free for 90 days. I am your cheerleader and coach, so you can ask me as many questions as you need. There's online training, everything you need to get started. Or there's a mini kit that's $99, and everything is the same except for you get $275, $280 worth of products and paperwork. Everything else is the same, so it's really just a personal choice between which one you want to do. Your only obligation is that you will do two or three parties. See if you're liking it. If you do, keep going. If you hate it, you keep everything that was in your kit. You keep your commission you earned, and you go about your business. Last question. I should have parties on a consultant. Um, Visa. Yes, we can host our own parties as often as we want. Um, so if you're wanting to do like open house and that kind of stuff, we can host as often and we still get paid on them as if it was someone else hosting. So you're just acting host and consultant. So yes. Any, that was our last card, but any other questions? Y'all had great questions. I think you still oh, have one. Have you ever done like a school fundraiser? Like I have. How, do you, how would you do that? Like did you get certain products out of catalog or today? The whole catalog. You just do the whole catalog? I've done one several times with my um, kids' middle school band, and each person gets a folder that has one catalog, five order forms, and a, a parent letter, okay. and it's set up on the website so they can do online orders or collect. I run it for about seven to ten days, not any longer than that, um, and it's just the complete catalog, and they can collect orders from And that was really, I mean, that does, I want to do that. Yeah. Any other questions? Okay, let's see who's going to win our prizes. How did you pick the cards? Sir? They're all hearts. They're all oh, hearts. Just, okay, they're all mini Oh, I have dime. Yeah, I act like that's the heart. Someone stole my eight oh, hearts. Yes. Oh. <laughs> okay, so we have three prizes. One is the little mini whipper, great for making little smoothies or hot chocolate, stuff like that. We have the bamboo spoon. Love the bamboo spoon. And this is a retired season's best. So it's not the same one that you guys signed for Jennifer that's in the catalog. This is a retired one. And here's how it's going to work. I'm going to call out cards. The first three I call out, come pick one of the prizes. Don't get attached to it because you're not keeping it. It's called stealing hearts. So we got to go oh. until we get to the end. And if you'll just put your heart up here so we make sure we've gone through all the cards. So who has the jack? Pick a prize and eat prize. And put your heart on the table. Oh, Alright, who has the seven? Pick a prize. No, oh, hang on, my foot's slay. Somebody pick it. <laughs> what do you want? I want a bottle there. Alright, who is our queen for tonight? Alright, so Dana, you get the mini whipper, and now we're going to start stealing. Who has the two? Me. Alright, so you get a steal. Uh, I want the, the mini whipper. And here's my card. Alright, who has the six? Okay. You get a steal. Keep what you have and steal. Is that you just things? I know. God, what a ball. Please don't. Please don't. Alright, who has the ace? I do. I want the spins. Oh, sure. <laughs> and the five? I do. You get to pick another one? You have all three of them. Alright, the 10. I have that too. Oh, <laughs> yeah, but she's not going to keep them. Alright, the four. Oh, I got it. I want the spoons. Oh, the nine. I got the nine. So we got to steal again. 
Right. Right. So again, uh, the whipper. The egg and diamonds. I want the spoon pack, please. And the three. Spoon pack. And that should have been all the cards. Is that everybody's? No, no. no. Chris has got one. Oh, the key. What? Chris has the king. Yeah, well, I see. Okay, so king. I put it in the wrong. I don't know where it's the king. Well, I'm gonna throw it to you. I was gonna throw it. I was like, no, that's not what I'm gonna do. All right, and so you guys may truly keep your prizes, but that's our silly hearts. Okay, we're gonna do one more prize for a little door prize. Um, if you guys will fill this out completely, fold it in half and hand it to Jennifer. On here, there's a place for a Facebook friend. If you would like to be friends with me on Facebook, I post recipes and specials. Sometimes I run, run my own sales. I don't tell you every time I go to the bathroom. I will tell you, you will see pictures or videos when I'm at the lake or in the football season when I'm in Auburn. Um, but I won't tell you every time I go to the bathroom. So just write your name, how I can look you up. Don't just write yes, like I'm Sarah Barnhart McGuire. Write how I can look you up. If you decide not to confirm the friend request, that's okay, you won't hurt my feelings. Then there's three questions to answer on here. The first is if you're interested in hosting your own show. Yes, maybe, or no. Jennifer's going to get credit for it. The earliest date I have is May 18th, so I'm not going to come to your house next week. You've got a couple weeks to prepare, or I have a couple dates in June. Then the second question is if you're interested in more information about the business. Yes, maybe, or no. I'm not the Pampered Chef Stalker, so I'm not going to call you every hour on the hour. I'm not going to put your address in my GPS and show up and park outside your front door. I want people to host with me that want to, and I want people to join my team that want to. Because it doesn't do me or you any good if I had to talk you into it. And then the last question is, if Jennifer became a consultant, would you host a show for her? Yes. Everybody's going to put yes because you are her friend, so you would help her get started. It doesn't mean she has told me she's going to, but about 70% of my hosts do become consultants, so it's what I use to help them get their business started. And then I will pass these around. You can stop it. Thank you, ma'am.